Pastor at Augustana Lutheran Church hosted a rally today to encourage more congregations to protect immigrants from deportation. And he also responded to reports that Multnomah County Sheriff deputies were found to be helping ICE agents deport immigrants despite reassurances that wasn't happening. Our Jennifer Dowling going beyond the headlines and she reports live from that church tonight. Jennifer. Good evening. The pastor here at Augustana Lutheran tells us that the sheriff actually came here to the church to reassure the congregation, immigrants, and advocates that they would not be helping ICE to deport people. However, with new information out, they say this is having a chilling effect. You know, we live in a time of mass hysteria. And at Augustana Lutheran Church, an interfaith group vowed to provide sanctuary for those targeted for deportation. So they come, they can come here, be here, and live here until things get resolved. The Latino rights organization CAUSA also used the opportunity to take aim at newly uncovered emails that show Multnomah County deputies assisted ICE agents in deportations. There was a clear violation of the law. Sheriff Mike Reese told us yesterday an internal investigation was underway. And if we find out that employees have violated state law or our policies, I'm going to hold them accountable. ACLU believes they did break the law here. Is that your initial opinion? We're, that's part of our uh, complete and thorough investigation that we're doing is to ask the county attorney's office for a legal review. Because the defense attorney said at least two of the men targeted didn't have prior convictions, CAUSA believes it's a violation. Oregon law restricts local law enforcement and all state agencies from using resources, personnel, or equipment to enforce federal immigration law for undocumented residents who have clean records. William says it's disappointing and it is eroding trust in the immigrant community. In their act to help ICE, Multnomah County resources and staff are complicit in separating families and mothers from their children and contributing to the destabilization of Multnomah County residents. The pastor here says he'll be doing some investigating of his own. Now the sheriff was here a couple months ago in the sanctuary declaring that the county would not cooperate with ICE. So I'm very amazed to hear that. I'll call him up and ask him. And we were told here today that many immigrants are too afraid to leave their homes right now because of fears of deportation. They say that this new information with emails will likely make them too afraid to contact law enforcement to report a crime or assist with law enforcement efforts. Back to you. Jennifer, thank you.